Acting is a Class on the Chaitanya Charitamrita, Ajalila, Volume 1, Chapter 1, Text 1, given by His Divine Grace, A.C. Bhaktivedanta Swami Prabhupada, recorded on March 25, 1975, in Mayapur, India. Isam, Isam, Tat Prakashamscha, Tat Shakti, Krishna Chaitanya Samvata. Krishna Chaitanya is Krishna. That was observed by Sarva Bhoma Pastacharya. He composed one hundred verses praising the glories of Lord Chaitanya. But because Chaitanya Mahaprabhu was playing the part of a devotee, uh, he torn out the slokas. Uh, because it is not for me. That was Chaitanya Mahaprabhu's humbleness. But the devotees no, that Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu is Krishna himself. Sri Krishna Chaitanya Radha Krishna Nahe Anna. Radha Krishna combination of Sri Chaitanya. Chaitanya Mahaprabhu means uh, Radha and Krishna combined. In the beginning, there is Krishna, and then Krishna divided into two, Radha and Krishna. And then again combined, that is Sri Chaitanya. <coughs> Radha, Krishna, Pranaya, Vrikiti, Allādhini, Shakti, Asma, Sri Kātmanāvati, Deho, Vedo, Gato, Dho, Chaitanya, Prakatamadhuna, Tadvayam Chaitkamaka. So, the Goswami Siddhanta, that Krishna is one. There is no rivalry with Krishna. God is one. Eka Brahma Dityana. There cannot be many gods. Uh, so, when God, Krishna, wants to enjoy his pleasure potency, that is Radha. So he manifests himself, uh, manifests his energy, his energy and he, there is no difference. Shakti, Shakti Matayo, Abheda. The Shastra says Shakti and the Shakti Mat, and one who possesses the Shakti, Shakti means power, potency. They are equal. There is no difference. Just like uh, the sun, sun is the powerful, and the sun sign is the power. So there is heat in the sun, and there is heat also in the sun sign. There is light in the sun and there is light in the sun sign also. Therefore, qualitatively they are uh, one. So far heat and light is concerned. Uh, but the temperature of the sun and the temperature of the sun sign may be different. Maybe not actually there is difference. This is the basic principle of all philosophies. Achinta Veda Ved. Achinta means inconceivable. Veda means different and Abheda means non different. Uh, the whole situation, uh, the one is there, God, but he has expanded himself in different ways. Ega Bahushyam. So, 
So that is described here. Krishna Chaitanya Sangata. Krishna Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, he has expanded himself as Guru. Uh, the Guru, the spiritual master, he is also Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. Sashad Haritte na Samastha Shastrai Rupta. In all the Shastras, Guru is accepted as Krishna. Sakshad Haritte. So Sakshad means direct. Just like you offer your devotion, respects to Guru, so that respect is offered to Krishna. Guru also does not think himself that he is Krishna, but he collects the devotional services of the disciples to offer to Krishna. This is the process. We cannot approach Krishna directly. We should approach through Guru. Tasmat guram prabhadrita jignasu se uttamam. There is a injunction of the shastra. The one should approach the guru who can transfer the service from the disciple to the supreme person. So, <coughs> therefore, the first offering is guru, bandhi guru. Then Guru creates many devotees. Uh, Guru's business is to uh, canvas on behalf of Supreme Law. That is Guru's business. Uh, Krishna says, Sarva Dharman Paritajya Mamitam Saranam Bhaya. So, you give up. Uh, all material energy. Sarva dharma means in the material world we have created so many so-called duties. This is our material disease. Uh, people are interested in material engagements and they have created different varieties of engagements. Uh, sociology, uh, communism, uh, this is that is philanthropism, altruism, uh, internationalism, nationalism, many, many duties they have created. Uh, that is all material. Uh, Krishna, out of his uh, causeless mercy, starts the children. <coughs> out of his causeless mercy, he comes. He descends. Jada jada hi dharma sa glani bhavati bhavati. Glani, this is glani. Human life is meant for one thing, athāta brahma jīgyāsa, to inquire about the supreme absolute truth. But instead of doing that, they have created so many isms. That is their misfortune. Real business is athāta brahma jīgñāsā. This human life, nature gives us the opportunity to inquire about the absolute truth. We have got the intelligence. The cats and dogs, they have no intelligence to inquire about the absolute truth. The trees, the plants, the aquatic, the animals, the bees, the uncivilized man, so many, eight million four hundred thousand forms and species of life. Uh, out of that the civilized man, the Aryans, Arya. Uh, Arya means the person who has got godly qualification. This is the meaning of Arya. Aryan, advanced. Uh, Aryan does not mean godless society. Uh, they are non-Aryans. Real Aryan means uh, because we are part and parcel of God, naturally we have got in minor quantity the qualities of God. That is natural. 
But on account of our material association, those qualifications are covered by upadhi, by various designations. This is our material disease. Material disease means just like a gold is covered by dirty uh, things. Similarly, we are actually gold because part and parcel of Krishna. We are small Krishna, uh, very small, but we are also the same quality, but it is covered. This is our deal. And this coverage are going on uh, in different names. Uh, socialism, uh, communism, communism, and this is so many. Uh, I am Indian, I am American, I am Hindu, I am Muslim, I am white, I am black. These are all daily. So it is the business of the guru to clear up this designation, dirty things. Therefore, Bandi Guru Isha, uh, Guru, that's offering because he is the agent of Krishna. Krishna says that you give up all this designated dharma, take to real sarva dharma and paritvajya, maam ekam, that is your real business. But uh, uh, even Krishna, Krishna does not fail, but this Krishna does not force. See, even on, upon the request of Krishna, we do not give up our designation. This is the difficulty. Uh, Krishna said, Sarvadharman Paritraja Mamekam Saranamal. When nobody practically accepts the Pandavas and few other devotees, uh, nobody took it seriously. And what to speak of now? We are talking of Bhagavad Gita, scholars of Bhagavad Gita, but without Krishna. That is everything. This demands that preaching Bhagavad Gita without Krishna. Nobody preaches about Krishna. Nobody says what Krishna wants. Sarva Dharma and Paritpaja, Krishna wants this. But they are misinterpreting in different way and diverting the attention of the people most foolishly uh, that in the Bhagavad Gita Krishna is the center. So this is going on. You know you are coming all from foreign countries. Uh, Bhagavad Gita is popular in your country, at least among the scholars and philosophists and theologists going on for the last two hundred years at least. But nobody understood Krishna. That is the difference. Now for the last, say, five or ten years, because we are presenting Krishna as it is, it has become very easy for you to accept it. Unadulterated Krishna. Before this, everything was presented other uh, adulterated. Therefore there was no effect. So if you push on this movement, unadulterated Krishna, it will go. Uh, it will go. And as soon as you adulterate Krishna, it will not go. It will not be effective. You may be very good scholar or very good politician or this or that, but he will never understand what is Krishna. Nāham prakāsa sarvasya yoga māyā If you want to pollute Krishna, Krishna will never be revealed to you. Sevan mukhi jīvhādau svāyamai vaspurta. So, by the grace of Krishna, you have taken the shelter of the lotus feet of Krishna. It is great fortune for you. So, do not adulterate Krishna. That is my interest. Try to understand Krishna. And to understand Krishna, the Krishna himself uh, taught that was also difficult 
then Krishna as Krishna Chaitanya teaching as how to approach Krishna. That is Chaitanya Chaitanya. Chaitanya means spiritual, living. And Charitra means character. So Chaitanya Chaitanya means that the supreme living force, Krishna. The living force is Krishna. Therefore we contradict the so-called scientific theory that life has come from chemicals. Matter. No. We are trying our best. We have engaged our scientist students. Uh, they, are, they have already, one student has already written one small book, the scientific basis of Krishna consciousness. And we are going to publish another book. I have given instruction to the scientist students. What is the heading of that? Huh? Life comes from life. Oh. Yes. Life comes from life. That is the fact. These modern uh, scientific, so-called scientific theory that ma- ma- matter, life comes from matter, that is not fact. Uh, uh, because uh, our original person, Krishna says, Aham sarvasya prabhava. Aham. This aham what is applicable to a person. Person. And person means living force. So Chaitanya Chaitanya means that living force. He is a person and he is Charitra, he is characteristic. This is Chaitanya. And that is Amrita. Amrita means not dead matter. Mrita means dead. And Amrita means not dead, living force. So, he is living force, his characters, characteristics are also living force, uh, and they are, because living force, they are omnipotent. Na hannate hannamane sadhiri. We have got experience, what is living force and what is dead matter. That we have got experience. Uh, that is further explained by Krishna. The living force means na hannate hannamane sadhire, na jayate, na mriyate, kadachit. That is explained in the Bhagavad Gita. The living force is not uh, finished even after the annihilation of this body. Very nice statement by Krishna. We can understand living. In the life, when we are alive, the body is moving, we can understand what is living force. Uh, and we can understand further when the body does not move. Uh, that defines why the body was moving and why the body is not now moving. If we simply study this different supposition, we can understand what is living force. It is not very difficult. Uh, simply we have to understand now this living force is gone out of this body, therefore the body is no longer moving and it is a dead matter. This is, uh, so this Chaitanya Chaitanya Amrita means we are talking of the living force not of the dead matter. We should always remember. So the guru belongs to that living force. And Isha, uh, Isha means controller, everyone, that living force, guru, Isha, Isha Bhaktan, eh? Isha Bhaktan and Isha, so they are all living force. The Lord, His devotee, His representative, everyone, they belong to the spiritual platform, living force. Chaitanya Sangha Chaitanya means living. So that personification of all living forces is Krishna Chaitanya. See Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. People 
मिस्टर कृष्ण चैतन्य महाप्रभु बिकॉज बाय मिसफॉर्चून दे अंडरस्टैंड कृष्ण चैतन्य एज ए डिवोटी आर जस्ट लाइक सो कॉल साधु योगी लाइक दैट दैट इज मिस्टेक कृष्ण चैतन्य मीन्स दि ओरिजिनल लिविंग फोर्स कृष्ण तो सार्वभौम भट्टाचार्य ही अंडरस्टूड हिम श्री रूप गोस्वामी ही अंडरस्टूड हिम सिमिलरली दि फॉलोअर स्वरूप गोस्वामी सार्वभौम भट्टाचार्य एंड ऑल दि गोस्वामी दे विल अंडरस्टैंड कृष्ण चैतन्य महाप्रभु एंड वन हू अंडरस्टैंड और फॉलोज the path enunciated by krishna chaitanya mahaprabhu for them krishna is very easily obtained this is called chaitanya chaitam he who follow sri chaitanya mahaprabhu sri chaitanya mahaprabhu mission is described by sarvabhoom bhattacharya <coughs> uh, uh, sri krishna chaitanya sharir dhat पुराण पुरुष जितना फर्गे बैर यस वैराग्य विद्या निज भक्ति जोगम शिखार्थम एक पुरुष पुराण श्रीकृष्ण चैतन्य शरीरधारी कृपांग बुदेज स्तम तो श्रीकृष्ण चैतन्य सेम कृष्ण पुराण पुरुष आदम पुराण पुरुष पुराण पुरुष मीन्स कृष्ण द ओरिजिनल पर्सनैलिटी ऑफ गॉड वेरी ओल्ड पुराण मीन्स वेरी ओल्ड तो वैराग्य विद्या शिक्षार्थम बिकॉज वी आर सफरिंग हियर ऑन अकाउंट ऑफ सो मेनी डेजिग्नेशन तो श्री कृष्ण चैतन्य महाप्रभु कैम to purify as from the all this nonsense designation that is called vairagavi hmm. raga means attachment so and viraga this false attachment we have to give up that is practically uh, being manifested uh, by practical life how to love krishna how to approach him That is the characteristic of Sri Krishna Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, and therefore he is described in the Srimad Bhagavatam, eleventh canto, uh, Krishna Varnam Pisa Krishna. Krishna Varnam, he belong to the same category, Krishna, or he is describing Krishna always. His only business is to describe Krishna. But his complexion is not Krishna. No. A Krishna, a Krishna. That a Krishna means white, because Krishna had many colors. One of the colors was pito, golden, golden abhuta. So this a Krishna sanga panga saparsudam. This sanga panga saparsudam is described here that Guru. ईशम ईश भक्तान ईश अवतारकान तत्प्रकाशांश तत्शक्ति दिस इज सांग पांग स्टडी दिस चैतन्य चैता मिता नाउ यू हैव गॉट दिस इंग्लिश एडिशन वेरी इलेबोरेटली डिस्क्राइब फॉलोइंग दी फुट स्टेज ऑफ आर गुरु महाराज भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती ठाकुर Prabhupada. So uh, there is no such edi- edi- uh, edition of Chaitanya Chaitamrita, uh, very elaborately described, but it can be understood uh, by the advanced student. It can be uh, so advanced student. Anyone you can become advanced. Advanced means at least one should understand. That Krishna is the supreme personality of God. If you simply understand these two words, that Krishna is the supreme personality of God, then you are at one. 
It is not very difficult. Ah. Everything, all Vedic literatures are meant for understanding Krishna. Vedaishta sadvai ahameva vedam. So if you simply understand, what is that understanding? That Krishna is the Supreme Personality of God. <coughs> we have written in our Krishna book, Krishna the Supreme Personality. If you become convinced uh, that your study of Vedas finished, tepus tapaste sushnu ādhyā, anyone who understands Krishna, what is that understanding? Krishna says, Matta paradaram nanda kinchi jasti dhananya. My dear Arjuna, there is no more superior, uh, I mean, authority or person or truth than myself. Matta paradaram nanda kinchi jasti These few words, if you simply understand uh, blindly or openly, it doesn't matter. Because if you touch fire either blindly or openly, it will act. It will act. It is not that because I have blindly accepted Krishna as the Supreme Person, that will not act. No, it will act. Even if you have accepted Krishna blindly, it will act. Because the thing is the same. Either you accept in open eyes or blind eyes. So similarly, uh, if you accept this theory, this is not theory, this is fact, that Krishna is the Supreme Personality of God. These few words. Uh, then you are advanced to it. Immediately. Uh, take, take it from me. That simply this conviction that Krishna is the Supreme Personality of God. Then you are advanced to them in spiritual life. So uh, all these persons associate with Krishna, Sri Krishna Chaitanya, Sri Nitya Radha, Sri Abhita, and Ganada and Sivas, uh, all of them, they are one. One in this sense, they are all interested how to push on Krishna consciousness. Sri Krishna Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, he is trying personally, the Supreme Personality of Godhead, and Nityananda Prabhu, Adraita Prabhu, Srivat, Gagadha, they are trying to help. So, and to approach all these five Supreme Persons, he requires the help of Guru. Therefore, the Guru is offered first the respectful prayer, Mandi Guru. Uh, guru, Bhavachan, Purlan Namba, there are many Gurus, but they are not many, they are one, Guru Tattva. Just like Krishna has many forms, but that does not mean Krishna is different. No, Krishna is one. Similarly, Guru, there may be many Gurus, it doesn't matter. But their philosophy must be one, to teach everyone that Krishna is the Supreme Personality of God. There may be thousands of gurus, but the guru's business is to teach the disciple that Krishna is the Supreme Personality of God. That is the test of it. If guru is teaching something as nonsense, then he is not good. Guru na sasya, Satkarma nipuna vipra mantra tantra vishara. A Brahman is very expert in his business, in Vedic culture, Vedic mantras, tantras. That is the taste of the Brahman, that he is very learned. So Satkarma nipuna vipra mantra tantra vishara. Vishara is a very expert. Avaishnava guru na sasya. But if he does not know what is Krishna, or if he is not a devotee of Krishna, he cannot become guru. Shad Vaishnava Sabachava Guru. But one person who is coming from the family of dog eaters, the dog eaters are considered to be the lowest of the human being. 
So, sapata. Sapata means, sa means dog, and pata means eater or cooker. So, sapata, even a person is coming from the sapata family, uh, and if he is a Vaishnava, if he is a devotee of Krishna, he can become guru. On the other side, even born in a Brahmin family and very expert in Vedic ritualistic performances, mantra tantra visarada, he cannot become guru if he does not understand Krishna. So, therefore, guru is very important uh, uh, because uh, he has accepted Krishna, tattva darsivi, he has seen the truth, so therefore Guru is first of her. Uh, this is the taste of Guru. Uh, guru does not become Krishna himself, but he can messages door to door uh, to induce uh, that you become devotee of Krishna. This is sign of Guru. Bandhi Guru Nisham. Ishavala. Then it's a dispatch. Thank you very much. <laughs>